God promised me that I'd be married. One eternity later. Dear Pastor John, God spoke to me in 2020 and told me that a gentleman that attends my church would become my husband. Well, it's 2022 and it hasn't happened yet. Although God speaks to me frequently about the situation, my question is, what does God want me to do while I'm waiting? Why would Jesus give me this information knowing how long I have to wait and how frustrated and discouraged I'd become while waiting? Diving into this question, I think there are a few things we have to take into consideration and potential paths we can look at. Number one, much of the time we have feelings, inclinations, things that we want to happen and sometimes we desire them so much that we um, put God into it. Let me, let me just say it that way. We put God into it and then we begin to say to ourselves, well, this is God's will. God told me this would happen. God directed me to do this. I'm not saying God cannot direct people to do things, but I think we have to be 100% sure, number one, that we're hearing from God and not ourselves, which can be a dif difficult proposition at times. And number two, um, anything that we believe God spoke to us, we should be able to align with scripture. So, you know, if Mara, you believe that God spoke to you about a very specific man being your husband, um, that's fine. Um, but then if you really believe that, you're going to have to be very patient with that because uh, evidently God did not tell you the year this would happen, the time frame this would happen. Um, so you've just got to stick with it. Now, I think there's another possibility um, a possibility that you really like this gentleman, you desire this gentleman, and perhaps you generated uh, some internal uh, discussion with yourself about this man being from you and sort of, you know, couch the whole scenario with God. What I would say is seek God and ask him not for what you want, but for his will for your life. God, what is your will for my life? What is your will concerning this man? And I think maybe listen uh, a little more carefully and be open to any answer you might receive because any answer you receive from God is the right one. That's what I can say. I'm Pastor John. And if you've got questions about faith, life, relationships, etc., you can email me at john at myinspire360.com and I will do my best to answer you. Take care. God bless. <laughs>